Hey, it is Dave with Master German Odor Removal demonstrating how we get rid of odors in vehicles. This is a Freightliner. I don't know what model. It's big. And you can see it is 125 degrees outside right now. Not a joke. Um, this uh, sleeper cab has some uh, odor issues. And so there's the bunk folded up. So when you're prepping your vehicle, here's what you want to do. Make sure your windows are up. You can do that by checking that the power windows are up. Making sure there's nothing open. You're gonna get your AC running. So I'm on high, which is level eight with recirculate, cold, AC on, and um, you know, towards your face, it doesn't really matter. I wonder if we push that button, if that boosts it. So AC is running, recirculate's really important. Then if you're a dual air conditioning, um, you know, place, Make sure this one is on, you can see it's on eight and on AC and on cold. And I feel the air, can you even see that? Yeah, so I feel the air coming out. So this, the, the second air conditioner uh, location's running. Um, I always have a towel with me. And then everything is sealed. So all the portals are sealed. Um, there's no gas gonna get out. We use a gas vapor to fight odors. So AC's working. We have the curtains drawn, and then what I will do is we'll start it, we'll open up everything, right? Um, so that, but that's just such an easy way to hit your head. Um, but just, just start this, we'll get rid of everything, or open up everything. And then, um, and then when we start, you'll see, we'll just kind of close these part way, just so that the back end of this curtain is exposed to our odor removal. The gas vapor, so curtains are ready to be drawn, AC is on. I am going to, before I leave, I'm gonna turn this off. It's just so hot right now. So I'm gonna turn it off um, and I've checked to make sure that it does come on just with the settings that we already had. So we're good to go there. I'm gonna let it run for an hour uh, with not without running. With, with, you know, I'm gonna let uh, our bucket go for an hour and then this, the, the engine will be off and then I turn it on, let it run for a half hour. So if you purchase the DIY um, odor fighting kit, it comes uh, from me or from a show. It comes with its own custom buckets. If not, just go to a big box store, get a two gallon. And I like, if you are presented with a choice, there's a thin and a thick lid. I like the thinner lid, um, just personal preference. So, and then inside will be another bucket with a lid. Uh, and you might wanna, if you just uh, cut a slit on each side of your lid. So if you cut just here and here and then bend it up, you know, like that, and then just put it on here. Any spits and spurts, you know, just to keep from fabric from getting hurt. So, uh, and it comes with four tablets, accelerator pump, and a weighted tube. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put in our 44, 48 ounces of water in the inner bucket. We're gonna turn on our pump. That is our accelerator. Then we put the, the hose in, make sure it's working. It is working. So if you don't have a pump, you just got to add 20 hours to the timeline, right? So, and then finally, what you'll do is open your double XL odor fighting tablet. And very low to the water because you don't want splashes. There you go. Starts turning yellow. That means it is working. So I'm gonna put it back here, out of sunlight, closest to the source of odor. You see how it's vigorous? So it's an effervescent tablet, plus it's got the accelerator pump in there. And then, and those are the snaps that you hear. That will kind of spurt out if you, so that's why you might put a little flap over your inner bucket. So, and we're gonna let that run for an hour. Hold on a second, let me turn this off. So just like this, we're now gonna set an hour long timer. I'm gonna leave here. Let me get out and I gotta use my three point stance. Hold on. Don't wanna put anybody. All right, three point stance coming out. They have it on the door. Here we go. And then I'll leave this lid in here just so I can cap it when I'm done. Same thing with that lid. 
extras for next time. And then, oh, one last thing. Closing the curtain. So the UV light does not get in. And then we're gonna close the door. So that's it. Let it go for an hour. And then start the truck up with the air conditioning running. Use your proper PBE to go inside. Um, just start the truck or hold your breath and close your eyes. Not a good way to do it, but it's, it, you know, it is effective. Uh, and then start it and run it for half hour. At the very end, you'll just air the truck out for half hour. So, hey, super happy to help. Let me know if you have any questions. This is Dave at Master Germ and Odor Removal.